and welcome back to Simulate Gaming and welcome back to Colonia 1990 here on Farming Simulator 19. I fixed the fields! If you guys watched last episode, you know that all the angles and stuff were wrong. I'm back on version 1 of the map. Turns out there's an... E oh, something's loading in. Something's lo that's still loading in. So that's the one thing. Um, I had to reinstall epi uh, episode number 1, version 1 of this map. Apparently there's an issue with version 1.1. So we've got back to version 1 of this. Uh, so this is not seasons compatible anymore, unfortunately. But we weren't using seasons anyway. Um... But yeah, now the fields work great. So today, we are heading up to our grass. Well, we're going to do some uh, mowing today. Uh, we are going to get some hired help to follow us today in the tether. We'll get some hay. Yeah, we'll do hay. Um, so here's our mower. And we've got the tether. Oh, we need to get rid of the... Uh, we need to quickly move the sprayer and spreader out of the way. So we can get to the tether. We're going to go ahead and get Billy Bob to help us in the Ursus while we take the Zeta, of course. Um... Can't look around that far. Head tracking is not working today, but hope you guys are well, and I'm going to explain to you where I really have been for the last couple of days. So, for the last few days. So, there was a bit of a gap between my last video and then this video. There was Sandy Bay before this one, um, but the reason there was a big gap in between is because you may notice, if you have a keen eye, something different about my desk. And not the lights. Up. They've always been there. They're just now doing a different color. The keyboard's brand new. Um, also, the stream deck is a bit dodgy. Now, the reason for that is because I was playing Minecraft. Yeah, I like playing Minecraft a long time. Shoot me. Um, See, so yeah, I was playing Minecraft and I managed to spill... Oh, let's close that down. Managed to spill some tea um, over everything, which is annoying. So, my keyboard... My old keyboard, the red one, if you guys can remember that. It's basically the same keyboard, but this is the Mark II and it's the RGB, whereas the other one was the Mark I and was red only. Um, let's go this way. Let's go this way. Um, so yeah, I, my keyboard was completely knackered. I got it working again now, but I can't get the lights working. Um, plus this one was already here. So we have a brand new keyboard. So yeah, word of advice from myself. Don't drink tea around your computer. Or any drink for that matter. There's no drinks on this table anymore whatsoever. Apart from bottles with lids on and stuff. Right, let's get this tractor turned on. Get the handbrake off. So yeah, that's where I've been. I've had to wait for my new stuff to arrive. And of course, the situation currently going on in the world, deliveries for stuff are pretty scarce. So even my Amazon Prime didn't show up. Primely? Is that, a, is that a thing? Is that a thing you can say if you've got Amazon Prime? Oh, come on now. Who knocked that over? It was me, wasn't it? It was definitely me. Don't know how we're going to get this back over. Maybe if I give it a little love bump, will it knock itself back over? Nope. No, it will not. I have an idea. Haha. -ha. Not sure if this would be possible in real life. I have no idea how heavy this would be in real life. Oh. Getting that. There we go. We got her. I'm just going to go ahead and move her around like that. Cool. Right, try that again, shall we? So yeah, sorry about that. Uh, well, at least I have a brand new keyboard now. Um, if you guys are wondering why I have two stream decks here, I'm recording this directly after Sandy Bay. Uh, if you guys didn't see that, we had two of these out. Uh, we were driving the excavator. So if you haven't watched that, I recommend you go watch it. It was pretty fun to do. Still not used to using uh, two joysticks to drive things, but it's pretty fun to do regardless. All right, let's get ourselves backed up into this shed. We'll hook up the tether. So yeah, we're doing hay for this first field. Why not? I haven't done hay for a while. Uh, get her lifted up. Pull her forward a little bit. And let's get the PTO turned on. I'm assuming there's no cables for this. <laughs> Absolutely not. Right. So we'll get this on to follow me. Billy Bob can drive this and we'll drive the Zetor with the mower on. Right, there we go. Uh, control F. Right, Billy Bob, you ready to go? Sweet as. Right, let's get to the field. Right, okay, so this field right in front of us here, so make sure no traffic's coming, is our field. So we're gonna go just cut across here, get this unfolded at the back. 
And we'll sort of Billy Bob out as well, shall we? Right, stop. Uh, wrong way, let's get Billy Bob up and running. Oh, do I have to turn this off? I think I do, right, let's go to follow me on off. Right, so that's now heading away. We're going to go ahead. We only got one tractor, though. It would be very nice to be wind roaring this at the same time, but never mind. Right, let's get the mower turned on here. It's pretty dangerous, isn't it, when it's got no cover on it? Right, let's get the camera out so you guys have something to look at. And we can crack on this. See, I'm still really enjoying this map. Sorry I'm not pushing the videos out as uh, as quick as I probably could. I could probably record about 10 episodes in one go with this thing, but I don't want to just ram loads of one map down your guys' throat. So I'll try and mix it up with Sandy Bay. Uh, one thing, uh, so I had quite a good reception on to Sandy Bay. I had to restart from scratch because I had 1.1 if you guys saw that. Uh, I did a time-lapse video to show you what was happening just so you guys didn't go without anything. A few people really enjoyed that. So let me know in the comment section down below this video if you want me to start doing a time-lapse series. It'll be a completely different map. It won't be this one or Sandy Bay. It'll be a completely different map. Uh, let me know if that's something you guys want to see. Uh, I could probably push them out every day, to be fair. Like, the days where I'm not uploading my episodes, I could probably, honestly, just do a time-lapse video. So you guys would get daily videos if that was the case, because I ain't got to set all this stuff up. So yeah, let me know if that's something you guys are interested in. Shimmy around here. So yeah, we're currently. I just realised we're a pass in front of that guy, uh, the guy behind us, Billy Bob, because he's currently tedding what we're driving on, and we're mowing the row next to it, which is uh, pretty interesting. Let me just realise that. Right, currently, so we finished the field and now mowing wise. So you may have saw in that little time lapse that uh, our hired worker decided to give up on the first corner down there. So, no idea what that is. I don't think you can handle the angle of it, but never mind. We've got something to do ourselves now. We're just going to go ahead and do a anti clockwise pass real quick, just so we're definitely, definitely on the field. Like so. I missed a little bit there, not to worry. Now the Billy Bob's in the way, which is annoying. We're going to have to quickly move him. Has it grown back as we've been. I think that's grown back as we've been mowing it. I need to check the uh, plant growth rate in a second. Right, so we're going to be heading as well in a second. Uh, make sure we're still lowered. Yes, we are. So I'm going to do one of these because it yeah, has. It's grown back as we've been doing it, which is annoying. Look at that. What the heck? Where did that come from? Right, so we're just going to go up to this hedge here. Up on the uh, right. And we'll stop. It's not a hedge. Oh, that's a shadow. <laughs> I actually thought that was a hedge room down there. Um, right. Get this lifted, turned off, and folded away. And then we're going to do Billy Bob's job. So, this was meant to be tedded, ready to go now, ready to be uh, wind road. But, like I said, unfortunately, he refused to do it. So, we're just going to do quick work of this. Not worried about what it looks like. 
just want to get it done real quick. So start heading up and down the field again. Oh, can this move? No, just a little bit offset. I didn't realise this was a little bit offset. I thought it was dead centre. Could you technically use this as a win rule? No, probably not. Let's get it lifted up. Ah, oh, it's one of them. It's one of them that still magically works even when you lift it up, I can see. It's annoying. Alright, everybody, so we are now just finishing up the final headland here. We're going anti-clockwise again like we did when we were mowing, and we're pretty much done. So we're going to go ahead and get the wind roll right now. Like I said, we're meant to be doing the wind rowing by now, but um, unfortunately our hide help stopped, so we had to do the tedding as well, which is very annoying. Um, not to worry. So we're going to go ahead and meet up with the uh, Zetor again, just up the top. And uh, we'll get the wind roll. I don't know which tractor to use. We could use this one. We haven't really used this one as much, have we? Yeah, I think we'll use this one. Just... Just to switch it up a little bit, you know? Just to switch it up a little bit. Um, actually, I'll just need to go get a thumbnail real quick. <clears throat> right, let's go back to the yard. Did I fold the bower up? Yeah, I did. Okay, just checking. Oh, nearly missed the, the path then. Could have ended the badly. So yeah, we're going to get the wind roll. You guys have already seen me wind roll. Uh, we got a weird, like, side style wind roll if you guys didn't see that episode. Oh, that's just coming. It's good. Just a ch double checking. Is the R on the field planted with barley? Once again, texture is fixed on that as well. Thank goodness, because the uh, texture is really annoying. That bug that we had in the last video. It's bumpy, this row, isn't it? Right, let's turn down here. So yeah, we're going to use the Ursus if it can power it. I'm assuming it can, because this one doesn't even require power. It just literally runs off motion. Um, right, so I'm going to go ahead and leave the Zettel here. Handbrake. Oh. Wrong button. Handbrake. Get it turned off. And right. So I'll go ahead and put everything away later. Where did I put the windmill? There it is. Okay. There's the windmill right in front of us. Just want to quickly back up and get this uh, tether taken off. Oh, PTO, that. Oh, where's the uh, three point? There it is. It's hard to tell on this thing because it's basically just a bit of scaffolding. Some wheels on the end of it. Okay, back up a little bit. So I'm hoping it can power it. I'm assuming it can. Like I said, this just runs off motion. So it shouldn't be too difficult. Uh, get it lifted up. And we're we'll heading back to the field. Squeeze through here. Right, let's go back to the field. Right, okay, let's cut across the road once again, get the camera zoomed out. We should be good to go, so I'm going to do the... How should I start? Go down the middle. This, once again, is another one that just magically works even when uh, it's lifted. We'll start here. We'll start here. Just randomly in the middle. Drop it down. I'm excited. I'm going to try and get it as straight as I can. Try being the keyword there. Oh, shit. Do you know what? It is kind of struggling a little bit. But it's working. Right, now we go on to this side. And we do the same thing.
Okay, everybody. <coughs> Boop. Right, okay, so we have now finished wind rowing this. It's not very neat. I'm not very good with this style of uh, wind row at all, but at least it's done. So we can now pick it up with the baler. Um, but it's been a very time lapse here episode today. We've been doing some long winded jobs. I don't like really just putting them out because they're not very good content. So I just thought I'd speed them up with some nice music so you guys can uh, sit back and enjoy that. But yeah, this is now ready to be bailed. Um, and we also need to. I don't know what we're going to do in the next video. We're obviously bailing, but then. That's not going to take up a whole video, so I have to think about that. But I'm going to go ahead and leave this one here. Thank you very, very much for joining me. Like I said, it's been a bit of a time lapsey one today. I do apologise, but I don't want you guys getting too bored. So, yeah, I hope you guys had a nice cup of tea in your hand when you watched that or something like that. But, yeah, thank you very much for joining me. I've been Simulate Gaming. Make sure you hit subscribe to see more from myself. Hit that thumbs up button. It really, really, really does mean a lot. And I'll see you in the next one.